Hello guys, I'm going to unbox the Mac Mini from Apple. I bought the cheapest one with 8 core CPU, 10 core GPU, 8 gigabyte unified memory, and 256 gigabyte SSD storage. This one has a price of $500 which is very reasonable and to make the final product not very expensive I bought the accessories from other companies rather than Apple I'm gonna to unbox the keyboard and monitor at the end of this video and I will show you the final setup as well I'm opening the box. The product looks nice. It's very clean and at the size of a hand palm. Also, it looks solid and the weight is not very light. This is the manual. Uh, it has only one cable inside to connect to the power. let's check if anything else are inside the box no there is nothing else except this sticker and the manual at the back we have two usb-c and two usb-a and hdmi ports so with the hdmi port you can connect it to any monitor or tv before buying this, people told me you have to buy an Apple monitor to make the picture very efficient and good in Apple devices. But that was not true and I tried a Dell monitor and the picture was very clear and good on Dell monitor and it had a full hd resolution and uh, i really like the picture quality on my monitor apparently it has another cover on the ports so i'm gonna take it out from the device oh be careful it was close to drop down Also, it has the headphone jack, which is nice in an Apple device. And this is the final setup on my tiny desk. Now I'm going to unbox the Dell monitor for this device. The main box came inside the Amazon box and you can see all the details about the monitor here. I choose the white color to match it with my Apple device. This monitor is very cheap and the price is about $200 and it's 24 inch size with full HD resolution. This monitor has a power cable and one HDMI cable and you need to set up it yourself which is not very difficult and if you follow up the manual it's easy this is the back of monitor i'm trying to show you all the texts on products in case you need to have some information about it this is the power button and this is the control button and this is the power port and this is one of the HDMI ports
also I am trying to show you how to set up the monitor it's very easy and it has an a screw at the bottom that you can fix two parts together this part goes to the back of the monitor and it also has another screw here now I hang the monitor to the base column and you can see that it's very nice and also it has a cover on the second HDMI port in case that you want to have a very look and a smooth place at the back of the monitor and this part help you to organize the cables so they will have a look view at the back of your monitor This is the place for the HDMI 2 port so you can connect two devices at the same time to the monitor. For example, you can connect your personal laptop and also Mac mini at the same time to the monitor and you can switch between two devices. When you need your Mac mini, you can use your monitor for Mac mini and the other time you can use it for your laptop now i'm going to unbox the keyboard i bought this keyboard very cheap around 12 or 15 dollar from amazon um, i found the quality and the look very nice it's similar to the apple products and at the same time it's very cheap much cheaper than the original keyboards from apple here are the specifications and the manual it has a battery so it's not a rechargeable keyboard uh, i select the battery one because i think it has more life than the rechargeable ones here are all the keys on keyboard and this is the back of the keyboard it has on off button, a place for battery, and this is the keyboard description at the back. The keyboard weight is very lightweight and it's not very solid, but it's good and you can do your work with it. This is the place for battery and the battery is not coming with the product. You require a triple A size battery for this keyboard, and I'm trying to show you the sound of the keys on the keyboard. It's pretty silent. The size of keyboard is similar to the size of keyboard in a 14 inch laptop. So I'm going to compare it with my keyboard on my 14 inch laptop. You can see the size is pretty similar.